I don't find it strange, but some other people do, that we have stopped creating wealth. We've had a large number of increasing restrictions, and you've been finding two things. First, that we are more and more concentrating on redistributing the wealth we've got, rather than creating any more. To create more, you need a slightly freer society, and you need an incentive society. Naturally, when I see that happening, I look with very great alarm to societies which have gone even further left. That is, they've tried to redistribute even more and haven't had the incentives for people working hard on their own account, doing well for their families, and often then being able to create jobs for others. They've produced a much more prosperous society than we have. What has happened to us is that the redistribution process has gone on so much further that the standards here, say in earnings, are our lowest income earners earn about half average earnings, and our top in net take-home pay, our top income earners about only times. earn about four times. So that's a, a comparatively narrow gap. As a matter of fact, it happens to be narrow, isn't it, in Soviet Russia? Now, once you compress the incentives from the top down and say, it doesn't matter how much you earn, I'm going to take the lion's share away from you, then they say, all right, I'm no longer going to do the lion's part. And then they stop creating the extra wealth, which would both benefit them and benefit society as a whole. Once they stop doing that, they don't benefit. <clears throat> then there aren't any extra taxes to improve the schools or the social services. Now, do you see there is some point in some societies in a degree of redistribution, but once it becomes a depression on incentive to get on by your own effort, then you're denying all people the means of increasing the wealth of our people individually and as a whole. We would accept a moral commitment in a kind of society that jointly we do try to guarantee some basic standard of life, and indeed um, rather more than a basic standard of life.